What's happening, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, yes, Air Jordan Retro One Reimagined Royal. Uh, this one dropped today. I, today is November fourth. Today's the fourth. This one dropped today. Uh, this is the second installment of that Reimagined for the Retro Ones. We already got the the uh, Lost and Found, and then we got the uh, the uh, Retro Threes. Reimagine threes and now we got the reimagine one. So this is a spin on the OG. It's like all right, take the OG, a twist on the OG. It's like, all right, what if the OG, you know what I'm saying, look like this? So at first we got the uh Lost and Found, which was the age joint. They did the age effect. Now we're gonna be like, okay, what if the shoe actually looked like this? So that's what it is. So we got the Royal OG High retro one and they have completely suede it out instead of it being leather like the original they have completely suede it out um uh, matching box black and royal blue and then the style number is dz5485 color code 042 and in my opinion it's not bad you know what i'm saying it's not bad at all i like that the royal looks like a royal like i'm i'm just a fan of the shoe looking like what you know what i'm saying the you know it, it's, it's difficult to go from suede to leather and keep the same color blocking like it takes you know what i'm saying because suede and leather they're not the same material they are but they're opposites you know what i'm saying one is smooth and one is rough and uh getting that color in there you know what i'm saying like leather difficult but i think they hit it spot on so let's take these out the bag they wrap them both individually. So I'm gonna put them both off. And like I said, you're gonna notice what I mean when I take it out the bag. Take it out because it's like, it's still a royal. You know what I'm saying? Even though it's completely suede, it doesn't take away from us getting the original effect because you look at it like, okay, this is still a royal one. You know what I'm saying? Let's put them both off. It's still a royal one. And. It's nothing bad to say about it. It's really nothing that you shouldn't like. If you like the original, you're going to like this one because it's just a, you know, just a twist in the materials. So here you go. Air Jordan Retro High OG Reimagine Royal Suede. It's got a long name on this one, but I'm straight on. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't have to have them. Um, it's not something that I, you know, jumped on like, oh, I need these, I got these. First of all, blue is not even, you know, blue is not one of them colors for me. If this was a band, we'd be talking about it, you know, we'd be doing a different story right about now. But the fact that this is a a royal, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't a big fan of the royals, no way. And um, it's royals on on my on my original high OG, we was doing the top fives and, and I always put, um, you know, you're going to put your Chicago's number one, and then you're going to put your uh, your band. And then after the band, I always put the UNC. You know, the UNC is above the black toe and above the the royal and the shadow. You know what I'm saying? I do UNC, then shadow, then royal. If we're talking about top five retro ones, you know what I'm saying? So this will be at the bottom anyway. But I still like it though. I like it because it, it, it's still original. It still gives you that original uh, feel as far as an Air Jordan Retro One High OG Royal. You know what I'm saying? So they give you some close ups. We don't we don't review plenty of Retro Ones. They go to bottom. They go to side. Other side. Top. And then the back. Like I said, it's a high OG Royal. What's not to like about it? You know what I'm saying? I just don't have to have it. I don't I don't have you know what I'm saying? The the one original leather royal is enough for me. That's enough for me. I don't need to go crazy on royal ones. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, royal just it wasn't it wasn't one of those ones for me that made me be like, oh, I need this joint. You know what I'm saying? This is an easy, it's an easy pass for me. It's an easy pass for me. Edge Royal Retro One High OG Royal. Easy pass. Now if this was leather, different ball game, but the fact that it is suede, I don't need no I'm just not a fan of suede on retro ones. All suede, like yeah, a couple panels, but you give me a full suede retro one, I'm straight. It gotta be a dog ass color, like you know what I'm saying? A Chicago like this, a band like this, yeah, uh, even a shadow. But the Royal first, I'm straight on it. You know what I'm saying? There you go. And it come with extra laces, so you got Royal laces, black. Definitely need a white pair of laces and knees for me. You know what I'm saying? Definitely need a white pair. And that might throw some of people off because they're like, why would they throw the white? You know, but yeah. 
There you go. Tom. We entering into some crazy releases. We got the uh Midnight Navy Five. That's a fire one. We got that craft. I love that craft. I love joint is crazy. And then we got the DMP 11s. We got the Gratitude DMP 11s, uh, which is gonna be, you know, you know what retro 11s do. Uh, but I just think this colorway is different. You know, I had the original DMP 11s, and it was, it was like that. You know what I'm saying? Just those hints of gold on the Concord base. It, 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 it crazy, man. It's crazy. It really pops and a lot of people is going to gravitate to that shoe you know it's going to be one of those ones that you know sell good and you know get a good response you know so here you go royal you got that wings logo up top in black you got your panels your royal panels on the back royal check royal toe box white so royal on the bottom and then you got that suede and the suede is good like ain't no cap bro there's some good suede man there's some good suede you know what I'm saying? You know you can, if you can see the color change when you write the uh, sway back and forth, you know it's something crazy. So if you see how I go dark to light, dark to light, so yeah. So they basically, they saying, what if the Royal One had came out as sway instead of leather? And I'ma just say, it, a, it, a, it a, I had the same opinion of it now that I would have had back then. So it's the same for me, I'm straight on. You know what I'm saying? I think the fact that it's leather is what got me to get a pair. You know what I'm saying? I would I, I don't like suede on ones. I don't like uh I don't like suede Air Force ones. I, I don't like all suede. You know, all suede, like all whole suede shoe. I do a whole suede three, four, because the structure of the shoe is different. So three, four, five, six, you know. Seven, yeah, eight, yeah. Would I do an all suede nine? Probably, mm, yeah. Uh, tens, probably not the tens. Probably not the elevens either. No twelve. I wouldn't do an all suede twelve. No, all suede thirteen. Yeah, come that being route. Uh, fourteen. Yeah, yeah, but ones is just no. The, the shoe doesn't have enough structure to it for me to go all suede, so it gotta be leather. Here you go. We're gonna do this on foot. Y'all know we gotta get the on foot on there. Make sure y'all, uh, we definitely can see the momentum on the channel. Uh, Real Stinky Head Detroit, we got episode 38 on the way. Make sure y'all be, go like, comment, subscribe, so y'all have to miss none of that good shit, bro. Um, the show is definitely heating up, and, and we appreciate all the views. Y'all can see the numbers growing. Y'all can see the, you know, the fan base getting there. We appreciate y'all. Make sure you hit that website to uh, support. Uh, big, big announcement coming for the uh, the uh, eighth anniversary in about nine days. So you know we're gonna do something crazy. Eight years. What a blessing to be sitting here talking about shoes in this place for the past eight years and we still on that so you know what i'm saying let's get it if not we scream it if anything we're screaming it more than anything this this eighth year so appreciate the love shout out to everybody we're gonna get this on foot popping air jordan retro one high og reimagine royal suede there you go so how was it for you did you did you cop a pair was you able to get a pair um how you feel about the twist on the og make sure you comment 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 put in the comments uh let's run it up Share, 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 and uh, let's keep it moving. Uh, let's get it. Let's go. All right, now, on foot. Now, at this stage in the game, I know I ain't got to tell y'all how to wear no retro ones. You know what I'm saying? Just just put them bitches on and don't tie them tight. That's about it. You know what I'm saying? Y'all hey, know how to do this. You know, me personally, I ain't going to wear them like this. I tie them up a li little more, but they going to flop and, and, and be loose and just do all kind of shit. So... These don't look bad on foot at all. You know what I'm saying? These definitely look crazy on foot. You know what I'm saying? Just for a kick around, you know? All purpose. Ain't no telling what you can do on this. This is this is real life right here. You know what I'm saying? Just do it. You know what I'm saying? Like the, like the shit say, just do it. These crazy dog on foot. I don't mind them. I might even, you know what I'm saying, consider really pushing the point on a pair. You know what I'm saying? Because once you get these on, they comfortable as fuck though. They comfortable as fuck. 
I'm gonna change my mind. You see how those perspectives always come into play when you're dealing with sneakers anyway. How they look beforehand, how they look in, uh, in hand once you actually get them, and then how they look on feet. I know once I, you know what I'm saying? Once I tie these up and put my twist on them, I know these will look crazy and ridiculous. I know somebody wanna go get a pair after they see me rocking them, you know what I'm saying? Keep the socks, Nike socks, OG, the OG sock, the OG Real Magic Retro One. Let's get that, let's do that. All right, now. Let's get it. I'm proud of myself, motherfucker, I done it.